And the Barrio Logan College Institute and San Diego Oasis held the first ever Barrio Logan Literacy Festival for kids in that area. It's an awesome event. They distributed hundreds of books to struggling families and children who have a passion for reading. CBSA's Regina Yurita was at the event and talked to a family who visited. I'm on Evan Street in Barrio Logan next to the College Institute building. In this building is where I met seven year old Gavino, who before today only had three books at home. And today he got to take five free books. For some people, that might not be much, but for little Gavino, who can't even afford one book, it's more than plenty. I like Star Wars. You want I, that one? Yes. Okay. I think that's a great choice. Here. Okay, I'll just take one ticket. This is seven year old Gavino Garcia from Barrio Logan. Gavino likes to run, play with his brother Emiliano, but one of his favorite things to do is read fictional books with Emiliano. The only problem is that Barrio Logan does not have a nearby public library. The closest one is in Logan Heights, making it difficult for little Gavino to access children's books easily. There are local bookstores, but like any book, they can get pricey. Which is why the Barrio Logan College Institute, with the help of San Diego Oasis, two organizations that advocate for better access to education, hosted their first literacy festival. Dozens of children, including Gavino and his brother, got the chance to take home free books. I'm getting books and I'm getting tickets. Kids as young as five were given five tickets. With those tickets, they had the luxury to pick out any children's book of their choice. Gavino picked a book on bunnies and Spider-Man. He even read a few words from one of his books to me. It is. It is, uh-huh. What is that letter? A. The majority of children in Barrio Logan are bilingual speakers, and some kids are still learning to master the English language, which is why reading is an important element. But San Diego Oasis tells me kids in Barrio Logan are sometimes unable to practice reading because even their closest libraries are underfunded. So they don't have a personal library either. This literacy festival is a first for Barrio Logan, and it was open to the public. If you were not able to come to this event, there will be more. We'll have more details on that on CBS8.com. Reporting in Barrio Logan, Regina Yurita, CBS8.